Hi everyone. Today's book review is this, the Gatefold Book of the World's Great Warships. This book, published by Brown Books, all the way back in the mid-90s, uh, is comprised of 36 pullouts, or as they call them, gatefolds, which you'll be seeing up here in the corner, of a selection of warships over the last 2,000 years. There is a fun selection here, everything from Roman galleys right through to the Ohio class missile submarines. And the 36 ships that have been selected represent the evolution of those time periods. What is also good is, is that they have been laid out so that either contemporaries of each other, enemies, and ships representing two different strands of technological evolution have been combined together so that you can see not only the opponents but also different ideas being manifested in the construction and layout of these ships. It's fun to see the inside of these vessels, in particular the transitionary vessels such as the Devastation, the Warrior, the Glory or the Giuseppe Garibaldi and seeing how all these new ideas were manifested into these ships I like this book because it has some of my favorites. It's got the uh, super ship of the line, the Spanish Santisma Trinidad. It's got the Dutch Derutia, that wonderful looking heavy cruiser of the 1930s. <clears throat> and they even have a gate <clears throat> gatefold of the Soviet super missile battle cruiser, Kirov. And one of the most unique ships out there, well, not anymore since it's been decommissioned, but the nuclear cruiser, the USS Long Beach. All these ships have been covered in much more detail, and certainly much more academic detail, in many other books. This book is a great reference. It's wonderful for those who are starting out, learning about warships, and also for those budding artists who want to explore layouts, colors, and just see the insides of ships. It's a fun book. For its visual displays, great insights into the layouts of the various ships, this book is a three stars. Certainly, if you want a far more detailed and academic look at the various ships, there are plenty of other books <clears throat> dealing with all of them. But this book is a wonderful overview and a peek into the workings of a variety of ships over a variety of eras. So, if looking at the insides of ships appeals to you, then definitely hunt this book down. There are plenty secondhand copies out there available <clears throat> looking for a new home. And if there are any other books regarding warships, naval matters, let me know in the comments below and I will dig them through my archives. And if I have them, I will review them for you. So until next time, enjoy and happy reading everyone.